Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Today we're gonna be talking about how to make Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Today in this uh, short and easy tutorial, we're gonna be talking about how to make a pinch gesture recognizer to change an image size inside the screen. So as usual, we are going to start the new pro uh, actually start new project. But before that, I would like to show you what will be our output. So our output will be an image inside our screen that uh, when we pinch, actually with two spots uh, touch of the screen, we can resize this. So uh, in simulator, you need to put option, then you will have to. Uh, then as soon as you click or tab and then you you know and make between your fingers uh, wider then image will be bigger yeah here you'll see how big I can change it or I can say okay I want to make it smaller so I approach to fingers together and the screen gonna be uh, actually picture gonna be a smaller yeah so let's uh, start our project so first of all I close this one and then I'll go to file new project so I choose single view app then I go to you know I create iOS Swift Pinch Gesture Z1. So then we need to choose which directory or where you want to create it and then create it. okay so after this uh, we will go to to main storyboard in uh, main storyboard uh, what we do we will drag an image view inside here and then you know I make it a smaller okay so I want to place this image in the middle of the screen uh, to doing that first of all we need to fix the uh, size of this uh, image because if I align it, uh, you know, without f uh, fixing image, then its size will be as minimal as possible. So what I do uh, right now, I just choose this image view, then I'll go to the add new constraint button in here, and then I'll choose check mark wide and hide as it is to add two constraints so it's keep the same size with these two constraints also I'll go to align button and I say okay horizontally and vertically I want to be aligned okay so now with uh, position and size of this uh, object we are good uh, the second things we need to do we need to go to assets and uh, from finder we can drag our image here then we will go back to main story and we say okay my image uh, uh, in an attribute tab I say my image will be evil 
icon art so uh, now I need to connect this so I call assistant editor and from uh, here or here we just control drag on top of the class and uh, we name it view pinch and connect okay I can close the system editor then uh, I know what I need to do I'll go to view controller I clean up I don't need this uh, for this function for this tutorial but I need another function so that function will be pinched view uh, to do it uh, faster you know I'll just go to the previous uh, project which I did I copy paste from there and then uh, we will review it uh, when we are running the project so command C and then I'll uh, command okay I just go here window and uh, I come back to my project and I choose this part and command V so uh, we are good so what I do I just run the project and now I explain for you uh, so what I did in uh, just under uh, my IB outlet to view pinch I just add new variable I name it pinch gesture and it will be an instance of uh, UI pinch gesture recognizer and then inside my view did uh, load uh, already we have super that view did load so, so which call uh, this function from uh, super class UI view controller and then we will uh, add uh, targets uh, you know actually pinch gesture recognizer to this variable we said okay with target self trigger view controller dot pinch view also I add is user interaction enable yes or true and also I add gesture recognizer to this and then uh, you know we will go to actually this function so in this function what I need to do I just say bring sub view to front view pinch and uh, then uh, view uh, we do transform uh, with size of the uh, multi touch and scale I say one okay so uh, let let try now we know we do one uh, button we can so mm, I push option then I get two and as soon as I tap and keep tapping I can make this and make between my finger wider I can make it bigger as you see and again with uh, I, if I want to make it small I just need to approach my finger together here you go so that's it uh, that's all for today and I hope you liked it and this uh, was uh, a video from series of uh, six tutorial about gesture recognizer and uh, please don't forget to thumbs up also subscribe for more videos uh, which are coming every day and uh, have a good one also if you have uh, any question you can ask in comments also you can find link to the project just in case when you try to do it yourself then go through for you you can uh, go to the comments and find uh, you know 
uh, link to the source code of this project and uh, try it over there and uh, that's it have a good one bye bye